Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hello, my name is Nanavi, and today's video is going to be a question and answers. But before I get into this, I just want to say thank you guys so, so much for subscribing, my 100 plus subscribers, as well as I have just hit a milestone of 1k with one of my videos, and I'm so, so, so happy. Other than that, let's get straight on to this video. I'm going to be looking over here sometimes just because I have written all the questions down. So if you see me glancing, just reading out the questions but other than that I hope you guys enjoy this video please give it a thumbs up comment and subscribe you can also press that bell button down below and that will notify you every single time that I post a new video so the first question from Chelsea is what's your favorite healthy meals currently my favorite healthy meals is like salads chicken stir fry um, avocado on toast with poached eggs um and yeah chicken wraps and things like that those are really good from amy being quadruplets are you all close always wondered lol yes we are very very close i love my brothers to death they have been obviously with me since day one um they yeah i love them so 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 much and we are extremely close and i love them so much the next question is from Lacey. How do you deal with feeling low slash anxiety slash no motivation? Well, I would have to say that I do try to take as much time as I can for myself. So I like to take baths, um, go for a walk, exercise, go out and see friends, things like that. Just keeping my mind busy. The next question is from Shirley. What advice would you give your younger you looking back on your journey so far? Wow, that is an absolute amazing question, Shirley. Um, actually really love that question. Um, to my younger self, I would say I pretty much preach, have been preaching this ever since I was little. So everything happens for a reason and you are strong, you are worthy and you can do anything you set your mind to. And I'm so proud of where you have come so far in your life. Ugh, gonna get emotional. <laughs> you will accomplish things as well. You're successful, you're gonna be successful and we're gonna get there. It just takes time. So I guess that's what I would say to myself. <laughs> this is from Autumn. Who is your best friend? <laughs> this actually cracks me up because Autumn, you are my best friend. We have been best friends for 15 years and counting. We have gone through life together. And I just want to say, baby, love you so much. Yeah. <laughs> Jordy, if you could go back to Disney World, what's the first thing you would do? Gosh, um, I have actually thought of this so hard because TBH, I would go and pretty much, I don't know, I love all the rides and everything, but the one that sticks out to me would have to be Space Mountain. That was actually the very first roller coaster slash Disney ride I had ever gone on. So I feel like I would want to start a tradition and go to that ride every single time I visit Disney World. From Izzy, who was your favorite person on the Inter Islander? Drum roll, please. It is Izzy. She is my all time favorite, and girl, you know that. Um, we met on the Inter Islander through a mutual friend of ours and we hit it off since then. Um, so we were pretty much carpool buddies and she has been in my life ever since 2017 and I honestly, Izzy, I love and appreciate you so, so much. You have been such a rock for me. You are my favorite person. Well, FYI, I do love everyone on the Inter Islander. I love everyone. Spread the love. <laughs> From Jess. If you could go anywhere in the world, where would you go and why? That is actually a tricky question because I would love to travel the whole wide world, but the one place that sticks out would have to be Europe. That's one place I would love to go. I would love to go to the UK, to Spain, to see where my ancestors were as, I'm, as I am Spanish. Next question is from Stala. What is the 
biggest thing you love about Ellen. The biggest thing I love about Ellen, um, for you guys that don't know, Ellen is my partner. So the biggest thing would have to be his heart. He has a heart of gold and I love him so, so much. It's pretty much love at first sight. He is my soulmate. Knows me better than myself sometimes and I just love how much he motivates me he is my class clown i love him so so much i mean i could go on about him but we'll keep it short so from sarah what's your funniest job you've had so far and do you have any funny stories oh so i have actually worked in quite a few jobs i've been a beauty therapist i have worked at disney world inter island on the ships and the list can go on but um a funny moment there has actually been quite a few funny moments but one that sticks out would have to be at inter islander i gained a concussion what bro what are you talking about man from hitting my head on a fridge in the basement um i hit it on the fan and then after that, um, there was a rule that everyone had to wear their protective helmets. So, yeah, um, it's, to me it's quite funny because at the time, I mean at the time it wasn't, but yeah. That is pretty much all the questions I'm going to be answering for today. And yeah, comment down below any other videos you would like for me to film. And I'll be sure to check that out very soon. But until then, I will catch you guys in another video. I'll just make you cry. And I don't wanna fight with you.